So the cannon is now red and as you can see behind me, the paint job may not be exactly perfect. It's going to be touched up here over the next few days, but it was the tradition of rolling it through campus and letting everyone get a stroke of the paintbrush to turn blue to red. An army of red rolled through UNLV's campus, escorting a prized possession, the Fremont Cannon. The Rebels won the cannon back by beating Reno in the rivalry game on Saturday night. Now the nation's largest, heaviest, and most expensive trophy in college football is back in Las Vegas. I think it's absolutely exciting, not only for the team, but the community as well. It just shows how much this really means, you know. It shows how much it really means to Nevada, or well, not Nevada, Southern Nevada, let me be specific, <laughs> UNLV, you know, and these people. You know, so it's, it's an absolute great experience. Here we go. There was only one problem. It was still blue. That changed at the student union on campus where they painted it red. Players, coaches, students, anyone who wanted to take part was allowed to grab a brush. It's a UNLV tradition. You paint it in front of the students and everything. This is really cool, man. It's a great tradition that we have going on here, and we just hope to keep it going on now for years after years. It's a great experience right, right now. And, uh, it's a great feeling, too, when you see how much people come out and support us and are just happy to, you know, the cannons back in Vegas and staying for, you know, for 364 days or longer than that. Now the goal is to keep the cannon red, a goal that's already being implemented by the football team. We talked to our guys in our team meeting today. Hey, you know, I mean, it's great. We've won it two the last four years. That's a big deal. But now can we consistently do it? You know, now the you know, they're going to have a chip on their shoulder. They're going to fight to bring them back and tell you what we're going to dig in and make this uh, yearly tradition. Once the cannon is completely painted red, it is going to find its new home inside the UNLV football locker rooms inside the Lead Athletic Center. But once the Fertitta football complex is built and opens up in the spring, it will find a nice new home right there in the lobby for everyone to see. At UNLV, Kevin Bollinger, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas.